Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Pain, that is the title of this video. It finishes Aberdeen 1, Celtic 1. Lee Griffiths is very late when an added time. Um, it doesn't really mean anything, to be honest. It's a point, but it just means more embarrassment. It was a whole embarrassment game, to be honest. More banter, as I was saying, if, I was, if you were watching the Watch Online Guys live on Twitch, Lee and MYT. Um, before we get into a bit more discussion, guys, please subscribe and like. Um, you know, I've just I've just watched the whole ninety minutes of this game, and it's been absolutely oh jeez, I don't know, man. Like it's we've been absolutely atrocious. Um, I'll go from I'll just go from start. Kenny, why are we playing Kenny? I'll, I'll make a good point here. Kenny is absolutely shocking, right? I'm telling you that. Lost his man again, and that was a lead to the Aberdeen goal in the first half. Uh, Lewis Ferguson goal, or whoever scored, I don't know, but um, it was an absolute joke of a goal. And um, and John uh, Kenny's just standing there looking at himself, trying to think who to blame. He you were supposed to be Martin. You, um, what do you call it? Um, cost us so many goals in the last three to four games. It's a pure disaster. Um, give the youth a chance. Anyone is better than him. Give Anthony Ralston a chance. You've seen um, Caramel and Dembele come on for Scott Brown in the last ten minutes of the game. He played all right. You know, probably probably the best man in the park all night. To be honest. Um, you know, give him a chance because we're getting nothing to play for the league's official over, you know what I mean? Um Sorrow and Dembele on at half um half time and get Brown on the bench Aberdeen bench for the second half please. I just thought it was a good one there. Um and I thought it was another good one, should play a women's team, they'll do much better than this car crash. It was a car crash. Uh, why is Kenny even in a Celtic jersey after Sunday? It hurts me it physically hurts me watching Celtic play these days an absolute embarrassment week in and week out. I agree with that one. That's that's my how I feel right now. Absolute embarrassing. Get um, uh, Kennedy isn't our coach. We want we need the defence, our mid and forwards. The silence from the club re, um, for a new manager speaks volumes on how they have to look for the fans. Uh, the fans uh, look to the fans for granted. Disgusted. No pace and everything in the front of the in front of Ab in Aberdeen. Too many touches when it's only needed needs. One or two. It seems that there is a lack of responsibility from players, and they just give them the ball to Turnbull and expect them to prove some magic. Edward should be even wearing the jersey, never mind being on the pitch. He spat the dummy out, and will do it again at his next club when he doesn't get his way. Kedi needs to be kicked out of Celtic for good. Um, some are not trying, but the rest have no confidence. But we knew before the game, Kedi um, saying he had he has to keep the Euros in mind is shocking. Um, nothing to do with Celtic and the players should be played on merit not to keep match fit for the Euros yeah. Um start probably in the f yeah that one there yeah. um, you know I think the whole game was just really poorly to be honest I think it was just really I nearly fell asleep I was like as you know the Arsenal fan when they lose, they lost to Burnley I thought oh, you know oh, I think we're losing Aberdeen yeah, I'm just going to do this I just sat with mask because I, I couldn't be bored watching it it was absolutely atrocious um, did the board really think that going from Rogers to Lennon, Foster to Bain, Guillotine to Taylor, Lustig to Kenny, Dembele to, Kam uh, to Kamala Yeti, etc., was ever going to work whilst banking millions on the players sold? The downsizing have been massive over the past few years. It's been major, and this is why we see that what we see on the park today. Absolute car crash from the board, and I totally agree with that. I never thought I would see the club sink so low again. Players who don't want to be there. Management team that doesn't have a clue and continues to pick the same players who don't want to be at the club. The board have a big job ahead of them to win back the fans after the disastrous season. Absolute no flair or energy in this team and the players who have that are on the bench. We have one, we have one of the easiest teams to play against with a deep defensive line. We're literally clueless on how to break a system down um, with regality. Uh, so make two subs, but we don't change shape of the team, which clearly the shape has not worked all night. Switching off, this is dire. Uh, that's what I felt. I've switched off and I've seen Lee Griffith score, but, you know, uh, a point. You know, what's I going to do this season? You know, what's I going to do now? Nothing. Um, um, think of the only positive for us. There's only three. This is one of the few things we learned. There's only three and a half games left this season to endure. Finally. Uh, second thing we learned i got to say is, John Joe Kenny should be there. Third thing we should learn, why are you playing the players that don't want to be the, for the jersey? They don't want to play, they, want, they don't want to be there, they just want to have the bloody money. Um, uh, why are we persisting with Lenny's favourites? Blah, 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 the club is season. Um, I've got a couple more here. 
Um, surely John Kennedy can't still uh, can't still be in the running for the manager. He was a defensive coach and we cannot defend any type of set piece disaster. When your body defensive coach as um anterior manager can he tell you how to defend a, a set piece? Well, there's a problem right there, pal. Um, they should have played every game to win, but those players are not interested in Kenny Defo. Not the answer. It's sad to see how far they have fallen. Well, it seems the jersey, the jerseys does shrink and has all, done all season. Kennedy's clueless and couldn't run a bath. No surprise. Time to stop playing those who won't be there next season. Brown, Edward, Beaton, and Kenny. That's all the, the ones I was saying, etc. Um, shouldn't be playing tonight. Of course, they were absolutely rubbish. Boring game. Um, some are not trying, and the rest have. Oh, I said that one. Um, why play the dud again? Starting playing fresh players, hungry to play, not in uninterested players. Um, Celtic board so so two full backs for thirty five million and replaced them with two reject loan players. Nothing else is said. That 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 sums up Celtic. That sums Celtic's board up. Um, in one bloody one question, you know. Um, it just sums it up. Um, so I um. I'm going to leave you on that note, guys. Please subscribe, like, guys, and we've been watched. I'm not watching, guys. If you're watching on Twitch, come on, man. I'm some banter there, but um, that, that's what I thought of the game tonight. Yeah, it's absolutely. Uh, I don't like that. I think anything else about the game, it was absolutely very boring. I was sh I'm just tired of it, man. It was just really tiring. Um, that's it, really. You know, I mean, Liga has got a late equaliser. I've never seen the goal. Um, I switched it off at ninety minutes because I couldn't. I, I switched it off because it was absolutely boring. It was. It was really. I was nearly falling asleep. So I knew, I switched it off, and then the score. I seen the score. Sorry. Um. So it's kind of like guys, and I'll see you guys um in the coming days or weeks or something. Um, any Celtic news or stuff, guys. And I'll, I'll see you guys then. Peace.